Good day! We are Group G and we're here to present our project entitled Python-based image recognition for aircraft detection and tracking software. So here's Mr. Clifford Tupas to discuss the overview of the project. AI image recognition works by using machine learning algorithms to analyze and interpret visual data. The algorithms are trained on large data sets of image which allows them to learn patterns and features that are common to different types of objects or scenes. AI image recognition is a powerful technology that is revolutionizing many industries from healthcare to daily life and security. The application of this technology are vast and varied. In aerospace industry, this technology can be helpful in security or military and civilian application. This demonstration of our group shows how we can integrate computer programming into the aerospace industry. The Python-based image recognition for aircraft detection and tracking software has the following objectives. First is to utilize Python programming language to build a program that is relevant to the aerospace industry. Second is to build a program that will detect and track an aircraft from a camera or footage. Third and the last objective is to develop a simple application with the indicated program. For our project, we used OpenCV PNG for object detection. OpenCV for Python is a powerful tool for developers who want to work with computer vision and machine learning. With its vast array of functions and tools, developers can perform various tasks such as object detection, face recognition, and even augmented reality. In our case, we used OpenCV for aircraft detection in footage or using a camera. By providing pre-trained models and algorithms, OpenCV for Python makes it easy for developers to get started with this task. Additionally, it provides various tools to help with the training of custom models, allowing developers to create their own computer vision applications. CXPRIS is a popular Python library that allows developers to create a standalone executable from Python scripts. This means that you can distribute your Python applications to users who don't have Python installed on their machines. The library works by freezing your Python codes and all its dependencies into a single executable file. This executable file can be run on any machines that meets the system requirements of your applications. CXPRIS and OpenZB are powerful libraries that offer developers the ability to create advanced Python applications with your computer visions and machine learning capabilities. Thank you. In the project, we use one of our library is Tginter. Tginter is an open source library used for making user interface in any in almost any Python program. In our project, we only use Tginter for the first user interface which is for the user to select webcam or select file folder and a brief description of the program and a credit of who made it. So this is our source code. In our source code, we'll be using OpenCV2 for our computer vision, then the Ginter for some user interface. Here we have classes, and here we have the DNN model that we will use for our computer vision to recognize images of an aircraft. Here are different classes and functions that we use, simple functions to execute basic commands and basic UI for the user to use more user friendlier and this is the while loop this is where the whole program will run and repeat itself and this is the setup source code where it will set up the main program to, to become a standalone program I will show you how I will show how will show you how it works now let's run the main python when we run the main python oh wait no 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 oh, interrupted um main python run it will give us an option to use webcam or select video file when we select video file it works it detects an airplane let's try another one 
it detects two errors. Close it again. Close. See, that's the basic program. Now, in our setup, let's make our own application, a standalone where you don't need to install Python, say, Tinker or OpenCV. Run, running build. Let's build our application. This will take a few seconds. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Done. So the this whole program can now run on its own without installing Python and other libraries. When we go to our documents, program, our detection, we have this build model, this build, where where the program is built. This is the, the program, it became a executable file. Let's first put the DNN model for the application to use our model to detect airplane. So when we run, it is, sick as it, it is the same as our Python from here. Select so video file, sample, it will detect the airplane later. See, it works. And that's all, that's the brief of the program. That's the brief of the source code. Thank you.